guys, I'm Michelle Doherty and today we are talking about catch lights. Now a catch light is a particular highlight in the subject's eye that is caused by a light source. And in the studio you can use a soft box or you can use a ring light which will create a ring in the eyes. The soft box will create a square or a rectangle in the eyes. In motion photography and in still photography, photographers always aiming to bring life into the eyes by capturing these catch lights. Even in cartoons, you'll see these catch lights are drawn in to make the character seem more amicable. So when I'm shooting with natural light, there are ways that I can achieve catch lights in two scenarios, outdoors or indoors. Outdoors, the most important thing is to find a piece of shade and to place your subject on the perimeter of the shade but facing the sunlight. So the sunlight will create beautiful catch lights in their eyes and they're not going to be squinting. Uh, their eyes will still stay wide open and bright and the light will be even on their face but the skyline or if you place them facing a white building, a white delivery truck, anything like this, it can act like a reflector and those shapes will be uh, catch lights in the subject's eyes. And seize the day. If I'm shooting indoors, the number one thing, the first thing I do is to find a window. And this will create a beautiful diffused light. The shapes of the windows or the shapes in the glass will pick up in the subject's eyes. So when I'm location hunting, I always keep my eye out for a piece of glass that is facing a background that I know I can blur out and create lots of bokeh with. And then I will get the catch lights in the subject's eyes, which is my goal, and also create a beautiful abstract background, which is in my style, which is what I like to look for. I'm Michelle Doherty, keep delighting in the details. Take my word for it, the answers are